Today, Fletcher and I are at the San Pedro River at Charleston to do a stream flow measurement. We are making this measurement to verify that our gauging station is reading correctly. Today, we're going to look inside the gauge. Also, we're going to look at a wire weight that's used to reference the stage elevation of the river. Last, we're going to do a stream flow measurement. Comes Fletcher. This is a high rate data collection platform, also known as a DCP. We see that the monsoons are about ready to show up. Maybe we'll see some today. Fletcher's getting his pygmy meter ready. I'm going to do a spin test. A spin test is done to make sure that the meter is still in calibration. It should go on till for about a minute 20, minute 25. You got your key? Yep. Well, it looks like it's, what do you think? It's half a CFS or? Something like that. 0.6 CFS? I think he was saying something like around 0 0.6, 0 0.5 something. Butcher's going to get a wire weight reading now. That'll reference the gauge uh, with the water surface elevation right. Because instead of having a staff gauge, lower this down and get a gauge height. You can see right next to the wire weight, we have the gauge sensor, which is a radar sensor. Now he's going to get a reading. Yeah, and this is the reference. We get a stage reading from the gauge sensor. This is the way we calibrate it. We uh, get a wire weight reading, and so that'll verify the gauge reading. This uh, wire weight reading should be the same as the, uh, the gauge reading. It's right on. All right. Fletcher's starting his current meter measurement. He's measuring velocity with the pygmy meter, depth with the weighting rod, and distance with the tag line. Fletcher will measure the velocity, depth, and distance in 20 to 25 of these subsections. Our depths are about 0.35 per section. Well, that's about a third of a foot. All of these measurements of velocity, depth and distance are put into the aqua calc to give us a final discharge. The measurement we made today was 0 0.048 CFS, it's about a half of the CFS. You can see the radar sensor right next to the wire weight. The gauge pool is this pool area. It's created by a constriction in the stream channel about 80 feet downstream from the gauge. Looks like it's raining just upstream. So, this may be the uh, first day of the monsoons down here. 